My dear friends, do you ever have those moments where you stop and wonder, am I doing the right thing? Am I on the right path? Well, let me tell you something straight from the depths of my being. If you're seeking goodness, if you're striving to spread love and kindness, if you're walking with integrity and compassion, then my friends, you are absolutely on the right path. And you know why? Because God himself is saying it to you every single day. Think about it. Look around you. Look at the beauty of the world, the intricate design of nature, the miracle of life itself. Do you really think all of this is just random chance? No, my friends. It's the handiwork of a divine creator, a creator who has a plan for each and every one of us. Now, I know life can throw some curveballs our way. We face challenges. We encounter obstacles. We stumble and fall. But let me remind you of something crucial, even when we feel lost and alone. God is there, guiding us, supporting us, lifting us up. You see, being on the right path isn't just about achieving success or reaching a destination. It's about the journey itself, about the growth and transformation that occur along the way. It's about becoming the best version of ourselves, about living in harmony with God's will. So. If you ever doubt yourself, if you ever feel like you're not good enough or you're not making a difference, I want you to remember this. God sees you. He sees your heart. He sees your intentions. And He is cheering you on every step of the way. And let me tell you something else. You are capable of more than you could ever imagine. You have within you the power to overcome any obstacle to weather any storm, to shine brightly, even in the darkest of times. So don't you dare give up. Don't you dare lose faith. Because you are exactly where you're meant to be. Doing exactly what you're meant to do. Believe in yourself, my friends. Believe in the goodness that resides within you. And most importantly, Believe in the love and guidance of a God who is always by your side, whispering to your soul, you are on the right path. Now, let's delve a bit deeper into what it truly means to be on the right path. It's not just about our external actions or achievements. It's about the state of our hearts and the purity of our intentions. Being on the right path means living with integrity and authenticity. It means being true to yourself and true to your values, even when it's difficult. It means standing up for what's right, even in the face of opposition or adversity. But here's the beautiful thing. When we walk in alignment with our values, when we strive to live with integrity and authenticity, we open ourselves up to a world of abundance and blessings. We attract positivity and goodness into our lives, and we become beacons of light for others to follow. So if you ever find yourself questioning whether you're on the right path, take a moment to reflect on your actions and intentions. Are you living with integrity? Are you treating others with kindness and compassion? Are you striving to make a positive impact for those around you? If the answer is yes, then my friend, you are most certainly on the right path. And you know what? God is smiling down upon you, showering you with his love and blessings because he sees the goodness in your heart and the sincerity of your efforts. But let's be real for a moment. Life isn't always sunshine and rainbows. We all face our fair share of struggles and setbacks. We make mistakes, we fall short, and we wonder if we'll ever measure up. But here's the thing. God's love for us is unconditional. It doesn't depend on our successes or our failures. It doesn't diminish when we stumble or fall. In fact, it's in those moments of struggle and adversity that God's love shines brightest, lifting us up and guiding us forward. So if you ever feel discouraged, remember this. You are never alone. God is with you. Every step of the way, cheering you on and guiding you forward. Trust in His plan for you 
and trust in your own ability to overcome whatever challenges may come your way. Beloved friends, let's explore how we can strengthen our connection with God and deepen our understanding of His guidance in our lives. One powerful way to nurture our relationship with God is through prayer. Prayer is not just a ritual or a formality. It's a sacred conversation between us and the divine. It's a time to pour out our hearts, to express our gratitude, to seek guidance, and to find solace in His presence. When we pray, we open ourselves up to receive God's wisdom and guidance. We align our hearts with His will, inviting His presence to guide us along the right path. So let's make prayer a priority in our lives, carving out time each day to connect with God and seek His guidance. Another important aspect of walking on the right path is cultivating a spirit of gratitude. Gratitude is a powerful force that can transform our perspective and uplift our spirits. When we take the time to count our blessings and acknowledge the goodness in our lives, we open ourselves up to receive even more blessings from God. So let's cultivate an attitude of gratitude in everything we do, thanking God for the blessings we've received and trusting Him to provide for our needs. Let's look for opportunities to serve others and spread kindness wherever we go knowing that our actions have the power to make a positive impact in the world. And finally, let's never underestimate the power of faith. Faith is the bedrock of our relationship with God, the foundation upon which we build our lives. When we have faith in God's plan for us, we can face any challenge with courage and confidence, knowing that He is always by our side. My friends, one crucial aspect of staying on course is cultivating a deep sense of self-awareness. This means taking the time to reflect on our thoughts, emotions, and actions, and being honest with ourselves about where we stand. Self-awareness allows us to recognize when we may be straying from the path of righteousness and enables us to course, correct before we veer too far off track, Moreover, self-awareness empowers us to discern the gentle whispers of God's guidance amidst the noise of the world. It allows us to tune into that still, small voice within that nudges us in the direction of love, compassion, and righteousness. So let's commit to nurturing our self. Awareness through practices like mindfulness, meditation, and introspection so that we may better align ourselves with God's will. Another essential component of staying on the right path is cultivating resilience in the face of adversity. Life is full of challenges and trials, but it's how we respond to these obstacles that ultimately defines our journey. Instead of allowing adversity to derail us, let's embrace it as an opportunity for growth and transformation. Remember, my friends, that God does not promise us a life free from hardship, but He does promise to walk with us through the storm. So let's lean on Him for strength and courage in times of trouble, knowing that His grace is more than sufficient to sustain us. Furthermore, let's draw inspiration from the countless examples of resilience and faithfulness found in the pages of Scripture. From the steadfastness of Jube in the face of unimaginable suffering to the unwavering faith of Abraham as he journeyed into the unknown, the Bible is replete with stories of ordinary people who overcame extraordinary challenges through the power of their faith. Now, let's explore the significance of discernment and trust in staying on the right path. Discernment is the ability to perceive and understand what is truly important and valuable in our lives. It involves distinguishing between what aligns with God's will and what leads us astray. Developing discernment requires attentiveness to the promptings of the Holy Spirit and a willingness to seek God's guidance in all aspects of our lives. 
in a world filled with distractions and temptations. Discernment is more important than ever. It enables us to make choices that honor God and contribute to our spiritual growth by seeking discernment through prayer, study of scripture and wise counsel. We can navigate the complexities of life with clarity and purpose. Furthermore, trust plays a fundamental role in our journey of faith, trusting in God's wisdom, goodness and sovereignty allows us to surrender our worries and fears and place our confidence in His unfailing love. When we trust in God wholeheartedly, we can rest assured that He will lead us along the right path and provide for our needs. Trusting in God also means relinquishing our desire for control and allowing Him to work in His perfect timing. It requires patience, humility, and a willingness to surrender our plans to His divine will. As we cultivate trust in God, we experience a profound sense of peace and assurance, knowing that He is always working for our good. So let's explore the profound impact of perseverance and obedience in staying on the right path. Perseverance is the steadfast determination to continue on our journey, despite the obstacles and challenges we may encounter along the way. It's the refusal to give up, even when the road ahead seems long and difficult, perseverance is born out of a deep conviction that the path we are on is worth pursuing, no matter the cost. In our walk with God, perseverance is essential. There will be times when we face trials that test our faith, moments when we feel weary and discouraged. But it's during these times that our perseverance is put to the test. And it's through persevering that we grow stronger in our faith and draw closer to God. Think about the heroes of faith mentioned in the Bible. Abraham, Moses, David, and countless others. These were ordinary people who faced extraordinary challenges, yet they persevered in their obedience to God's call. Despite their flaws and failures, they remain steadfast in their commitment to follow God. And as a result, they left a legacy that continues to inspire us today. Obedience is another crucial aspect of staying on the right path. Obedience is not just about following rules or regulations. It's about aligning our will with God's will and submitting ourselves to His authority. Obedience requires humility and surrender as we acknowledge that God's ways are higher than our ways and His plans are greater than our own. When we obey God's commands, we demonstrate our love and reverence for Him. We show that we trust His wisdom and believe that His way is the best way, even when it may not be the easiest or most comfortable path to take. And in return, God blesses our obedience and guides us along the right path, leading us to a life of purpose and fulfillment. My friends, if you've been inspired and uplifted by the message shared here today, I encourage you to share it with others who may benefit from its wisdom and encouragement. Let your friends, family, and community know about the powerful insights we've explored together and invite them to join us on this journey of faith and discovery. Additionally, if you'd like to stay connected and receive more uplifting messages, sermons, and reflections, I invite you to subscribe to our channel. By subscribing, you'll receive regular updates and notifications whenever new content is available, allowing you to continue growing in your faith and deepening your understanding of God's love and guidance. Together, let's spread the light of hope and inspiration to all those around us, sharing the transformative power of faith and encouraging one another to walk boldly on the path of righteousness. Thank you for being a part of this community, and may God bless you abundantly as you continue on your journey of faith. Now, let us conclude this message with prayer. 
Dear God, I come to you today with a humble heart, asking you to lead my steps in all aspects of my life. I pray for your guidance and direction as I navigate through my financial journey. I trust that you will provide for all my needs and bless me with abundance. Help me to be a good steward of the resources you have given me and to use them wisely for the betterment of myself and those around me. I also ask for your healing touch upon my body, mind, and spirit. Please remove any pain or sickness that is preventing me from living my life to the fullest. Whether it be physical, emotional, or mental, I know that you have the power to heal me completely. Help me to trust in your love and grace and to find peace and comfort in your presence. Lastly, I ask for your protection over me and my loved ones. Shield us from harm and keep us safe in all our ways. Protect us from the dangers of this world and guard us from the attacks of the enemy. May your presence be with us always, guiding and protecting us through every moment of our lives. Thank you for loving me unconditionally and for always being there for me. I put my trust and hope in you. And I know that you will never leave me or forsake me. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen.